So I have a Cessna 150 and I am out of town for this event followed by, you know, a month of traveling. So right before I left, and this is something that I had not really heard of or seen, but it's been around since 76. Yep, 1976. So this was originally developed way back in the day because Phillips Petroleum was based out of Bartlesville. So pretty close to where these were actually uh, and still currently assembled. So we were approached way back in the day to try to develop an engine oil that, that could be used as a rust and preventative, okay? This does not contain ashes dispersive. So the whole idea of this was is that it would be used, it's the right viscosity, it's a 2050, so you can go out, crank the engine, yes. right, in cooler temperatures, but yet still be able to run it up. So you can actually add this in, and use this in two different ways. You can use it as a pickling oil. So we actually had a gentleman come in, said that he actually uh, picked up an airplane from a neighbor uh, that had actually been pickled for 10 years using, XC, or excuse me, using the aviation anti-rust oil. Opened it up for an overhaul, not a spot of rust on the whole inside. The way it works is, is it coats metallic surfaces exactly mm -hmm. as you were explaining it. So that coating prevents moisture that's in the air from corroding the cylinder walls and other uh, oil wetted surfaces. So you can use this at a 10% top treat. So if you got a 10 quart sump, you can add one quart in it and it help prolong and boost the crust and corrosion inhibition. The other way you can use it is, is as that pickling oil. It allows you to go up. If you need to do any maintenance, you can actually go up, fly up to 25 hours on it before having to change it out, come back, uh, as long as you're under that 25 hours, put the aircraft back in the hangar, and you're still good to go, you're still gonna maintain that rust and corrosion, as long as you don't turn the pop prop through. That's the key. After you turn that engine off, you don't wanna move the pop prop through, otherwise it'll displace that, that film. Um, straight grade versus multi-vis and the oil retention that happens on the cylinder walls or other oil wetted surface.